Now, as you can see, if you go over here, there's a sliding door that will open up and uh, you will have access to the balcony through the bedroom. All right. So therefore, you can come out, check out this nice, beautiful view when you sit back and listen to the water run. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already go ahead and click that red button right there and also click that bell for notifications and select all all right those games and graphics we are back in the building with another GTA 5 my video for you and we have another beautiful house to show you today I got a Franklin's Angels out here over at the one beach house shout out to T1 yep 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 so we're going to leave these ladies right here and start making our way out to this new house. It's uh, pretty far up the highway, you know what I mean? But uh, we're going to go check it out. Let's go ahead and head to the garage first. Let me check on my bartender real quick. She was supposed to take a nap and stuff. Uh, let's see. Oh, nope. Doesn't look like she took a nap at all. All right. Well, let's go ahead and head out to the garage. All right. We still got the snow bunny out there practicing. All right. <laughs> so this one is going to be up the highway like i mentioned earlier it's pretty much going to be nothing around it um i would say that this will be perfect for like a getaway somewhat of a like a vacation spot yo 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 what's up with my mechanic yo all right hopefully all my cars are filled up with gas and ready to go yeah buddy so for today we are going to be taking the cadillac swing out today all right Mr. Texas Maid is going to be coming out with us today. There we go. All right, so let's go ahead and head out. Right through these doors. And as you can see, it is a beautiful day out in Los Santos. Hope you are having a good day wherever you are at. Good day or night. Let's go ahead and head out, man. We got the sun. We got the car clean. The mechanic to clean the cars. Looking shiny sparkles all over everywhere <laughs> all right so let's go ahead and open up and we are going to be going down in this direction right here yo so let's go ahead and head out we're going to be going up this way we got a full tank of gas we are all set to go all right so we are out here by the house Let's see, I believe this is it right here. Alright, like I mentioned, it's uh, pretty much nothing around it, you know. <laughs> That's why I said it's perfect for like a vacation spot or a getaway. Um, all you're going to have is like uh, some bikers out here doing a little off-roading or whatnot. Um, they're not loud or nothing. Um, during the nighttime, they're pretty much gone. It's just out here during the daytime. But this is going to be the house right here. This is the address, 6087, right here. Let's go ahead and pull into um, our garage. Just pull into the driveway right there. And we're going to have like a garage port. Alright. Which is called a port where you just drive in. You only have something over the top of the car. Okay. Instead of um, the back wall and the garage door. We're just going to have this port right here. Which is perfect. Nobody's pretty much going to come out here. Now as you can see you have this beautiful view right here yo. Does it get any better than this yo. For real. You got the nice sounds of the water flowing day and night. You're going to have uh, views of like, you know, all of the vegetation and of course some animals. You know me, you could do a little hunting out here or just take some pictures and whatnot. You also have your uh, scope out here, but you could take uh, more of a better view. And down there, if you look, you have a spot where you could go fishing down there by the water. So everything works out, man. All right, so let's go ahead and start off on this side. As you can see, you have uh, some nice planting and all that around on the walls. You have uh, your vines and stuff like that. Got some more plants and rocks right here as well. And if we go over this way, you will see a nice area. You save like a picnic table, if you will. You have your barbecue pit right here. More of some nice exotic plants. Kind of gives you like a, like an Amazon type of look right here, right? Because you are in the forest pretty much. 
so you have some more plants potted right there and if you go right here this will open up to your living room slash kitchen all right this will be a sliding door right here let's go ahead and enter and to our right we're going to have our living room as you can see we have our nice fireplace right there with our extra wood underneath uh the counter right here of our entertainment system got our flat screen tvs our speakers we got uh, some books and some balls up there with some signatures for some players around Los Santos. Uh, we also got a nice couch with um, a little stand right there next to it, a little table that can hold a couple of items like a remote, candles or whatnot, or something to drink. More speakers on that side. So we have a nice, comfortable living room over here. Definitely a nice, comfortable living room. And if you go on the left side, you're going to be in the kitchen. All right, you're going to have your coffee maker or espresso maker right there. You're going to have your stove right here, electric stove on the countertop. And you're going to have everything that you need, of course, you know, your knives and uh, utensils and stuff like that. Nice sink with two sinks there. And a nice shelving area for you to put your plates and your cups. Nice cabinet areas at the top and bottom. And the dishwasher right there underneath. And on this side will be like the bar stool area where you can sit down and eat at. Where you can serve some guests or whatnot. All right. So this is a nice kitchen area also. It has uh, pretty much everything you need. Um, your microwave and oven will be on the wall right above your uh, coffee slash espresso maker. <laughs> so everything that you need for a kitchen is right here. All right. Now, if you want to go to the next door, you want to go on this side. And this little neat little door will open up for you. And this will bring you to the bedroom. All right. This is going to be the bedroom area right here. As you can see, we have our nice bed. Everything's all furnished. We have um, also our two nightstands with um, some storage space underneath and inside those drawers. Um, on this side, you also have another stool right here. You can sit down. You have some custom paintings around. <laughs> that's pretty tight. Who's that? Uh, Aubrey? Okay. I think it's Aubrey. But yeah, that's a dope picture right there. I like that. Okay. So if you go over here in this door, this will be um, your closet area as well as your armory. All right. So uh, if you want to go hunting or just protect the house, you can put your weapons right here. That's where your wife, rifles will go at. And you also have a section for your tools and um, some more little space down there for storage. All right. So this is a nice area right here where you can share with your closet and your guns. Okay. Now, as you can see, if you go over here, there's a sliding door that will open up and uh, you'll have access to the balcony through the bedroom. All right. So therefore, you can come out check out this nice beautiful view when you sit back and listen to the water run very peaceful out here very peaceful I love it all right now if we uh, continue down this way on the balcony area you will come into a little bar stool area it's kind of like a little bar area for you you can sit down take some shots enjoy the view chill with your company that you invited over or whatnot and if we go back through this way back through the bedroom and head towards here and turn right here we will have another little neat sliding door okay that's going to lead us to our bathroom hey who's that handsome fella right there <laughs> so we have our sink you have your um your cabinet area right there on the side and your drawer area where you can keep your towels and stuff like that you have your shitter right there um you have everything you need in the bathroom right here yo and if you want to take a shower or bath, you will want to go over here. As you can see, we have another sliding door that's going to lead you to the back area of the house. And it will be on the outside. That's right. Right here, you will have your overhead shower right here, your waterfall shower. You also have your, you know, space you can place your shampoo and things of that type of nature. You have some seating area right here as well. You could dry off. And you could also walk on this... Um, it's like a wooden plank thing right here. <laughs> it's like a floor, okay? Like a wooden floor right here. You usually see these in like sauna areas or stuff like that. But this will lead you to the back area where you can take a bath in your bathtub, okay? So you have your shower and your bathtub outside, all right? You got your area where you can have, you know, you could put your um, different shampoos and conditioners all around the tub area, your soaps and stuff like that. And as you can see, you are blocked off from everything. So you can go ahead and enjoy your privacy back here as well. And going out this way will lead you back out to like the front of the house. Okay. Going to have your water hose right here. Some more plants and vines and stuff on the walls. All right. Adds on to the privacy as well. You know. Nice exotic area right there. 
and you also have a hot tub out here as well all right it's like a, a heated um, a heated tub pretty much all right you got um, all your stuff around here you can have your speakers right there listen to some music or you can watch some tv on the little tv screen right over there as you can see on the wall nice nice touch nice touch this is definitely a vacation house man you have your lawn chair right here with your pack of beer you can just sit back and relax and everywhere that you're at in this house you could hear the water flow you hear that I know you hear it I know you hear it but yeah you can hear the water flowing anywhere that you're at in this house yo pretty dope for a vacation spot man loving it loving it loving it all right so you go back in Yep, this one doesn't uh go in. I have to go out this way and then go back this way to the car right here. All right, so I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna chill out here for a little bit and uh chillax, man. I, I I don't know what you think, Frank. You know what I mean? Cause it's like we got this view right here. You know what I mean? Let's check out that fishing area down there. Let's do that. Let's at least check out the fishing area, y'all. Come on, Frank. Hey, hey, what's going on, y'all? All right, I'm having some people uh, moving in and everything. Y'all keep it down during the daytime, all right? All right, I'm going to have to come back here and bust some heads wide open. So, to access this little fishing area, you can find any way that's convenient for you to get down here. But uh, I'm just going to take this way right now. Bloop, bloop, jump down. Bow, just that simple. And you are down here at your fishing area. You're going to have this uh, little dock area right here. You could also dock your boat over here also oh 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 let me get out the water <laughs> so you have an area where you can dock your boat and you also have this area right in front of me where it is a chair not a folding chair okay don't get excited it's just a regular chair and you have a fishing pole already set right there for you all right so it's like uh everything's all set for you to go fishing man yeah this is dope i like this I think Big Ball and Frank gonna have to do a little fishing, yo. What you think? <laughs> yep. Let's go ahead and spark this up, yo. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this uh, tour right here. But if y'all enjoyed this house, man, let me know what y'all think in the comment section. And if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and smash that like button for me. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share the video with your friends that are in the modding GTA 5. Y'all, it's Games Graphics. Me and uh, Big Ball and Ass Frank. We are out of here. Till next time. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.